Hey everyone, welcome back to episode 6 of Monster High Retrospective. Today we're going to be talking about Freak Do Chic and its little mini lines that accompanied it, like Scarnival and Ghoul Fair. But I think we're going to like start with the little lines and go to the big line. Yeah. Oh, Tony's here, by the way. Hello. Trademark. Um, <laughs> gotta trademark those notes. Hello. <laughs> oh wait, that's not the balloon boy. Never mind. Is that what you're doing? No. Oh. Okay, so we're going to start over here with the Scarnival line. Um, these, I believe, are Walmart exclusive. I never saw them anywhere else. And they, like, are at the carnival where, like, they're performing. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure from the episode. Or at least in the episode, they were, like, wearing these outfits. If they were even in the episode. But we're going to start over here with Claude. Claude. He's just kind of simple. Mixed patterns. Lovers. These hideous shoes. Yeah. They, none of the little lines, like the, the budget lines, came with stands. He came with this mallet. Come on. Because he ran, like, a booth. He came with, like, a, a little, like, test your strength thing. I don't have it. I don't know where it is. <laughs> it's in, like, the, my big box bag of... um. Monster High stuff, and I do not want to look for that right now. <laughs> it's buried. And he came with, like, this, like, prize, I think. It's like a little balloon animal. Cute. Balloon flower. But we'll look at him. He came with this fedora. There's his face. I mean, it's a Claude doll. Like, they all look the same, essentially. <laughs> I don't know if he has hair under here. I've honestly never taken the fedora off, but it doesn't look like he does. Uh, Trying to maybe, like, pop it off. Brace him in there. Yep, he's bald. <laughs> I think that's the first. I mean, he didn't need to have hair, you know? Yeah. And he's got his, like, usual facial hair. Fully articulated, at least. Here's his outfit in a better light. And there's, like, claw marks all over the plaid material, and he's got a striped shirt with dog bones. All in all, a really cute Claude. Mm -hmm. I don't remember how much they were. I, I want to say twelve ninety nine or fourteen ninety nine, but I cannot remember. And here is Draculara. Honestly, it's probably one of my favorite budget Draculara's. I think she's so cute. She's, super cute. she's got like that uh, baby blue color that they tealy color they started adding into her color scheme later, and she's so pretty. Um, I could have picked a better one, but. She's fine. <laughs> um, she came with like a a game too. That like you're supposed to like throw this thing at like balloons or something. Oh. And I don't know where the balloon thing is. <laughs> but here's her face and her makeup. Her hair's down with the side part. I love the bow here on the shoulder. I love when they use this kind of like fabric for Draculaura. Mm -hmm. With like all like the filigreed hearts and the drippies and the bat wings and so Thank cute. You. And she came with this. I think it was like the prize, but like it's hers uh, now. It's hers now. and big version. <gasps> it's so cute. I'm gonna show Abuelita that and be like, I want, <laughs> I want this. Uh huh. Yeah. I think she could do it. Mm -hmm. Our grandma likes to knit. Mm -hmm. Here are her shoes. We've seen these about 153 times. <laughs> They're a good mold. They're fine. Mm -hmm. They're nothing special. Here's yeah. like what her hair looks like in the back. Typical like choppy, choppy <laughs> hair, but super cute nonetheless. My favorite from the Scarnival series is obviously Skeleta. <laughs> um, I don't remember if she came with anything else, but I, she came with this pinata donkey purse. Ugh. So cute. Yes. I don't care what anybody says. They took so much time and love into Skeleta. Like, Everything about her makes me happy. Mm -hmm. My, like, Mexican family loves the hell out of her. Mm -hmm. They knocked her out of the park. Here's her face. A little bit of differences in, like, the makeup and stuff. But She's it's her usual um, face up because, you know, the Day of the Dead. So it would have been interesting if they changed it up a bit. But I get it. Yeah. She's got teal in her hair this time. Super cute. I love that Skeleta always had, like, a really, really deep red lip. Mm -hmm. And here's her dress. It's very, like, authentic Mexican. that has got the papel picado here. Mm -hmm. 
and like that, like, like the flamenco style dancing dresses, right? I don't know. I don't think that's what they're called, but like, not flamenco. Is that what it is when like they're like twirling their dresses? I thought that was. Like, but like you know, like a mini because yeah. Monster High is always gonna do a mini, <laughs> and that's like the fabric. It's got like the marigolds on it, and then skulls and more filigree. It's so cute. Her signature shoes, but just in a solid color. It's fine. <laughs> It's fine. I gave her a yellow stand because she's special. <laughs> I stole it from a Freaky Fusion doll. Deserved. Deserved. <laughs> okay, and now we're going to look over here at Ghoul Fair. Um, I don't know if they were in the episode or what they were trying to do, but they were definitely tied into them because, like, their boxes had, like, the same artwork and stuff. But, like, they are more, like, fundraising. Oh. Like, um, sorry, I was taking a drink. Um, Scara has, like, a wash bucket, and she's got, like, drippy goo all over her. She's washing cars. Mm. Like, her dress is kind of cute. The pink stripes right there. Like, the sploogy soap marks all over her body. Bubbles. The lime green in her hair. Her makeup. What is that? Like, a gray teal, Tony? Uh, her makeup? Yeah. Yeah. But, yeah, she has got the superior hand mold, too. Ah! Yeah. That's the bucket she came with. I can't remember if she came with anything else. Um, you can just look up uh, Ghoul Fair and like their box art should come up. I should be more prepared, but <laughs> I just wanted to talk about them. Um, here we have Elizabeth. She's selling cake pops, and that's really cute. <laughs> and oh, she's like holding her stuff. Will you stretch her out so she's standing? Yeah. Thank you. Here's her them so here's her dress i'd better look at it it's got like a similar style to dracular's in terms of like the print on it just the filigree and everything but hers is like a spaghetti strap here's her face she's got blunt bangs and this like deep red color mm, not deep it's kind of more orangey red now yeah it's more of like a blood, uh, blood orange. like blood orange color it's super cute uh these are her shoes she actually did get an original sculpt if i'm not mistaken I don't remember these from before. They're super cute, just drippy, blood drippy with spider webs. And this looks like the base of like a perfume bottle, maybe. Cute. And bats in the front. Love that. Okay, girlie, you'll just sit here for now. <laughs> sit. <laughs> sit. <laughs> Girl down. Girl down. Okay, here's how lean. She's so pretty. I cannot thank 13 Wishes enough for giving me the pink hair. I would have been fine with staying with, you know, the super curly, like, texture. Mm -hmm. But just thank you for the pink hair. I will never say no to a pink haired doll. Yeah. She was selling balloons, if I believe. So yeah. she came with this balloon right here. The Monster High Skelet shaped balloon. Here's her face. She's got a middle part. I love Colleen's ears, like, with, like, the one down. So cute. And then her, like, bubblegum pink and blue dress with, like, graffiti all over it. And lips. That's something that came with the playset, I think. It's, a, like, a... It's a mustache. Yeah. <laughs> I just gave it to her so she'd have something else to hold. It's super cute. Yeah. And here is Heath. Yeah, I don't think that they came with anything but, like, the one little accessory they had. Um, he was, like, roasting marshmallows, because of course he was. He didn't come with these glasses. They also came with the playset that Rochelle came with. And this is his marshmallow stick. I like this Heath. He's cute. Heath has one of the best boy faces. It's just so, like, sharp and, like, elven. He's gorgeous. <laughs> and he's got a baseball tee on. Well, baseball, like, quarter-length tee. Is that what that's called? I don't know. And just these ugly shorts. <laughs> and he got a new shoe sculpt from what I can recall. Yeah, it's got flames all over it. So this is his. Would have been nice if he got them painted, but. <laughs> Let's see the glasses on him. Yeah. So cute. <laughs> That's how he's displayed in my collection anyway. So you're going to go down here because that was Ghoul Fair. Um, if you ever see them anywhere, I would actually suggest you get them because they're so cute. Mm -hmm. Okay, then there was the Target exclusive sets, which were Claudine and Twyla. So let's do Claudine. Love 
lots of controversy with Claudine. Lots and lots of it. Why? Because they changed her skin tone once again. And I actually do see the, the controversy in this one. Because they were trying to make her look black and white and old timey. Mm -hmm. But they left her purple. Like they left Twyla purple and didn't yeah. make her black and white either. Just gave her the black and white outfit. I mean, Twyla looks great. But I'm sure Claudine would have looked great in, like, a saturated black tone, maybe. Yeah. But I don't know. But here she is in a really, like, pale gray skin tone. Mm -hmm. It really suits her. She looks really beautiful. Yeah. And here's her makeup. She's the lion tamer, if you couldn't tell. She's got a corset right here with ribcage, like, ropes. Meant to mimic, like, a spine and, like, ribcage. And then this, like, filigreed, um, what did I just call this? I literally just forgot the word. Corset. <laughs> uh, it's got, like, a white trim and then black. Tool? Like, t no, this isn't tool. It's just, like, a ruffle. Ruffle. She's got, I don't know, zebra? Would you say that's zebra? <laughs> uh, some sort of animal print legging and these amazing shoes. Yeah. These incredible killer boots. I love those boots. Like, honestly, any girl could have these. Like, they're just so sick. The heel is amazing. Imagine them with, like, a painted lace, though. Uh, yeah. Mattel would never. <laughs> they wouldn't. Simply wouldn't. And then she has this, like, fluffy purple, um, like, overcoat. I don't know what to call that. <laughs> and like a super cute top hat with like a flower. I just imagine it like spitting water at you. Uh, but it is in a headband. She has no jewelry, only this necklace right here. I meant like earrings. Mm. And then she came with this flaming circle that Crescent's supposed to jump through. Cute. And Crescent came with like a mane and a new body sculpt. Crescent's so cute. Yeah, I love this Claudine. Mm -hmm. I recognize the controversy with her, but I still really love her. Yeah. I think she's gorgeous. Probably one of my favorite Claudines. Mine too. Okay, now let's do Twyla. I think this is my favorite Twyla. She's like, I, I feel like there's like no competition. <laughs> uh, she's got a huge, like high bun, curl, curled bun, and then curled bangs. Her makeup is so sweet. Like the the little curl cues all over it. And she's got like a hundred lashes. <laughs> and her really soft, like purple lip. She's so pretty. Oh, she came with earrings. Mm. Um, She's got, it's all one piece if I remember correctly, this whole thing. She's got bed bags all over it. Nasty, I Nasty. love it. Nasty. Uh, I think she's just supposed to be like a, like a stilt clown. Cause like, it's giving very Pennywise right here. Yeah. With like this diamond print right there. Harlequin print. She came with a bracelet and this tulle shirt and a ruffled neckline. I'll let you just take that in. <laughs> and it's like a cute little like short number. It's like, ah. <laughs> and it's got a tulle ruffle here at the, the midsection, but it's still attached to the shorts that are like tighter here. Then they get like poofier cute. near the thigh. She came with these amazing socks. That have these long, like Beetlejuice esque stripes, like just attached to the sock. And these shoes, these stilted shoes. Yeah, insane. Like they're so beautiful. They remind me of like those paintings of like, it was like Japanese paintings of what like cloud, Chinese mm -hmm. paintings of like what clouds look like, you know? Mm -hmm. That's what they remind me of. But like the stilt. They're so good. It ends with like. A square. Assuming it would make you want to cry. Tony is on... Have you watched The Last Holiday? <laughs> Tony has watched it like 80 times in the last two days. Yeah. I don't know how it's possible, but it's true. <laughs> Here's her shoe. These girls did come with a stand because... Oh, love that, Helene. Because <laughs> um, they were at a higher price point. I want to say they were twenty four ninety nine. Mm. So cute. And she came with Dustin... Who also had a new sculpt. Oh, I think Dustin's my favorite pet. 
He's super cute. And he's like playing the symbols. Oh, I love him. A dust bunny, please. <laughs> Mattel lost their mind at that point. They were like, let's give the girl that lives under the bed <laughs> yeah, a the dust bunny. Part. And it's like, yeah, bet. Yeah. Do that. Please. If you don't, I would like to see I it. will riot. Yeah. Okay, now this was like the main collection here. And Rochelle came with the playset. I don't know if I have all the pieces. I do. They're somewhere. But I don't know where they are. And everyone else came in like their own box. And they came with like artwork. I don't know where Frankie's is. I literally have no idea. It's supposed to be in my book of like diaries, but it wasn't there. So there's Torlies. Every other one is facing the wrong way. Love that. <laughs> so cute. Even like the skelet got like a little... Oh, the circus like clown yeah moment, moment. <laughs> they're meant to like so you can put them wherever you want like right there like while you're playing like mm -hmm. so and so is now performing and here's claudine hers is super cute mm -hmm. there's jennifer oh then i'm also hers. missing twilas wow what the heck jennifer I love her. yeah it's so so cute and i think this is honey yeah Oh, she's it. Mm -hmm. She is it. I, I could, like, scream. I did. <laughs> she deserves, like, acrylics. Yeah. Yeah, she's crazy. Okay, so let's do Frankie first, since she's right here. Frankie is a magician. Cute. I love her makeup. It's, like, Dusty Ray Bottoms who? <laughs> Stealing Frankie's look? <laughs> I think not. I don't think so. <laughs> She comes with a magician's wand. Let's let's focus on that girly. <laughs> well, take my word for it. It even has like the little. Um, come on, makeup guru. The little white end. She also has the superior hand mold and this hand mold. I love this hand mold. Mm -hmm. Should do like all about the hand molds. Because <laughs> you know what. Some of them are really bad. Yeah. And uh, I love her deep, like, burgundy lip. It's so beautiful. She also comes with a top hat, and it's got a stitch pattern all throughout it. Her gimmick was, like, you take this off because there's a peg in her headband, and you can make her hold her hat, take her hand off, and it's like her hand's coming out of the hat, you know? Oh. I would never display her like that. <laughs> <laughs> but... More power to you. <laughs> she came with curly hair. I've thought about like redoing this so many times, but I'm scared. Mm -hmm. I don't like doing Monster High hair. It's scary. Why? Because I don't know. They don't have very much of it. Like Rainbow High is fun because they have so much hair. Yeah. But like I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> and she's got a dress, and her pusnaki is always out. Always. Because it's so short. She would be dress coded every day in high school. There's mm -hmm. no way. Oh, she also came with like these like those rings. You know, like try to break them or whatever. Yeah. Scam. And she's got, like, spinning, like, you're in a trance stuff all over her, stitches. Um, this belt is attached, I believe. Or it might not be. No, it is. It's all one piece, which is fine because it's a really excellent piece. She's got the similar fabric to Twyla, only hers is in blue and black. Stitch above the thigh. Frankie shoes, guys, you're going to be... Gagged. Amazing. Okay, so yeah, they're like these amazing boots. They almost look like reptile pattern, like skin. And then you get to the freaking heel. A rabbit coming out of a hat. <laughs> oh my god. A rabbit coming out of a hat. And the hat is her hat. It's got stitches all over it. Yeah. And there's like studs running all along the edge of the shoe. She's incredible. She is simply amazing. And there's the back of her head. Oof. She's going a little yellow, but I, I don't think she actually had the... Oh, she has glue in her head. <laughs> Love that. I thought this was when it was done with... God, Mattel. Please. Why put glue in a doll's head? Makes no sense. <laughs> oh, I forgot to show the back of Claudine's hair. Because hers is so pretty. Just like the colors. It's, uh, it's predominantly that purple color. That like gray muted purple. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. Okay, let's do Jennifer next. 
She's so pretty. She has... She comes spitting fire out of her face. Cute. This is her makeup. It's the same on both sides. I love it. She came with bangs! <laughs> and she's got black, uh, red, and green hair. And this fiery headband. I love Jennifer. Mm-hmm. And then this fiery necklace piece. She's almost got like a masquerade thing going on, I think. Mm. I will say, though, that I, I, I could go for a different cut on the skirt. Mm, the skirt is very questionable. Yeah. <laughs> like, it's got that very, like, bat wing cut to it. Yeah. Which I don't think suits her. Mm. I would do, like, a shredded thing, like, it was, like it was burnt by fire or something. Yeah. And underneath, she's got that call back to that same fabric but in red and black i love it like circus tent circus tent circus tent. not beetlejuice sorry <laughs> someone's probably typing you dumb idiot <laughs> dumb, stupid, yeah. you dumb stupid ugly fat pink haired gay boy <laughs> please nothing can hurt my feelings <laughs> um i'm like why you don't have her yeah. i do yeah call me fat you don't yeah. have her yeah. she's 170 dollars right now pay oh, it <laughs> she comes with this fan and it's also on fire. I love it. <laughs> and her tail, as always. Her shoes are sick. Yeah. It's a dragon. Let's let's put this closer to the light. They, uh, it's like a dragon in the face. You can see its eye. So cute. Oof. And like a, the fan is the heel again. <laughs> it's got tassels. You can see the nose and the eye right there. And like the teeth. Yeah, she's insane. So cool. Literally deranged. <laughs> Literally. Okay. Move to the side, girly. <laughs> oh, maybe this one wasn't a good idea. There's <laughs> so many of them. And they're all like in very like specific poses and stuff. Okay, so here's Torlai. She is the best Torlai. And now she's crouching. Crouching Torlai hidden. Where's Jennifer? Oh. Dragon. <laughs> <laughs> Crouching Torlai head in Jennifer. Um She's amazing. I'm gonna have Tony like stand her up. Okay. <laughs> Here's like the two, the three other girlies. Uh, I think I'm gonna do Rochelle next. <laughs> so I can do like them together. Stand her up. Okay. Here's Torlai. Best Torlai. She's amazing. Oh, her hair just will not get out of her face. <laughs> She's so beautiful. More of those dots. She's got purple in her like fiery orange mane and black. And I'm not really sure what her headband is supposed to be. Maybe like a, it's like it's a crown type of situation. You can see it's like an umbrella with feathers. Uh, like right there, that's the umbrella. Uh, Let's do this. Yeah. Her dress is probably my favorite out of, like, the four girls. I think it's so... Not the colors so much. It's got, like, yeah. orange and purple and black and white. Yeah. And it's a lot. But, like, I like the cut a lot. Like, this is what Jennifer should have had. Yeah. This, like, ripped up, shredded, like, bubble skirt. Mm -hmm. It's so cute. She's got the similar belt as everybody else. Does Jennifer have that belt? Yeah. Yeah. Everybody has this, like, striped circus tent belt. And she and Jennifer have that similar, like, I don't know, like, spider webby mask-looking motif. And, like, sh like cutouts from the circus tent. It looks like fire. And then she's got the black and white underneath. Her shoes are also insane. They've got wheels and a cat in the front. And they wind up the back in yarn. And there's a yarn ball right there. A yarn ball! Her she like the platform is like a stage. Like have you ever watched Pinocchio? Like that really decorative stage that he uh. goes up on. That's what it looks like. Oh, and she comes with this super cute Can your umbrella. It's got eyes too. Mm -hmm. Umbrella. Nose too. And there's the handle. Cute. I love toil. I love the cat girl hand. Mm hmm so dainty and like evil <laughs> okay now let's do Rochelle who will be staying inside of her uh, <laughs> uh, swing 
So here's Rochelle. Rochelle came with the whole playset. So here it says Monster High along the top, and it's got like these flags waving. There's so many of these little spider webs in the corner with the filigree. And there's ropes. And this part's so good. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to make, like look like curtains, you know, like the circus tent curtain. Mm. So good. And then this platform with a giant skeleton stars in the center. And these, I don't know, I think they're nails, maybe? Yeah, like 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 they nailed into the ground. Mm. And then the place that's in the back, her picture was there. But you can interchange that with the other cards. So cute. I don't know. Maybe Rochelle is my favorite. I don't know. Um, <laughs> Rochelle being my favorite? The pink haired, like, soft, doe eyed face girl? Yeah. <gasps> no. <laughs> no way. It's got, like, wrought iron and hearts. It's so beautiful. This is my favorite place that ever. Mm. And then it came with that mirror back there, like a funhouse silly mirror. And then there's this tease of Manny Tar as the strong man yeah. in full, like, one piece and, like, long tied boot. Like, oh, please give us, give us him. Like, y'all premiered uh, Iris in I Heart Fashion after Comic Con. Premiere him in this. This would have been perfect. Yeah. Him, like, him and Rochelle should have come in a two pack in this set like that i would have paid like 80 dollars for this like no joke a hundred dollars for another manny yeah. like another manny i'd have like three of these freaking houses i would just buy him for manny and be like a lot of people don't like the boy doll so i'd be like here buy rochelle i don't care <laughs> i just need all these mannies manny in like a really tight singlet yes yeah yeah, yeah. oh yeah. yeah and so she's got a gestures hat on i love her she's kind of like the trapeze artist i guess i guess that's what kind of what twilight was too yeah uh no she's a tightrope walker because there's a tightrope included oh, yeah but she can't do it because you know dolls can't just stand like that yeah her she should have come with like pegs in her shoes uh -huh. on like a stand or something that you could like peg in i don't know something ridiculous that uh -huh. they would never have done yeah but here's rochelle her cute wings as always, she's got that, like, Jester's ruffled neck. And there's that little drippy, like, squirt you in the face with water flower. Mm -hmm. She's full-on Harley Quinn. She's got the pink and the blue. She's amazing. I think there's a crinoline underlayer here. Nope. I'm sorry, girl. Didn't mean to show your pussy. <laughs> and hers is the pink and white. Pink and black uh, striped shredded uh circus tent material right there she also got a new pair of shoes they're like ballet slippers and like oh my god look at them yeah, they're the, amazing the bows and like the they're ornate like more like vibrant on the camera yeah they're not this they're not this hot pink yeah they're they're pink they're definitely pink but, but not like hot not pink. this hot hot pink yeah, i don't know why they look so bright on camera and it's got like that engraved like french filigree you know what i mean Mm -hmm. They're so gorgeous. They're the same shoe. So here we are. We're gonna end with Honey Swamp and Gulipe. Gulipe was like the huge draw, no pun intended. Mm -hmm. Um she was the first 17 inch uh monster high doll on essentially a made to move body, you know? Yeah. And this doll can fit into Barbie clothes. So here is Honey Swamp. She is a marionette doll. So she's got like a similar body to Cedar Wood from her comic-con doll like her legs are nuts like yeah like she can like bend this that way i don't even want to show you my <laughs> throw up but her shoes are balloon animals balloon animal the monster high team was on something man <laughs> the when they did something right they did something right, right. no wonder mattel killed them to save barbie <laughs> they're like wait this is better than barbie <laughs> she's literally wearing a like fabric made out of tissue paper that doesn't go that doesn't show the print on both sides yeah. and you know what girl still the same to this day yep. they made no changes no. her shirt she's got a bubble uh skirt with the same uh, striped belt and that shredded um circus tent material i don't know these are really hard to describe like i don't even know what i'm looking at polka dots yeah. uh plaid stripes spider webs all of it hair. it's all of it and she's got a balloon animal purse so cute so cute this is her mug and she's got lilac hair predominantly is it like a sea foam in there too yeah 
Lilac and Seafoam. Like, that's one of the best combos, and Mattel loves that combination. Good. And, oh, her Harlequin makeup, the, like, the the eyelashes, like, going into those dots. Oof. Oof. I love Sunny's, like, creepy, like, alligator teeth. Hers and pom-poms. Speaking of which, did you guys see the leaks for uh, Series 2? Series 2 of oh. Junior High. <laughs> Crystal has pom-poms. <laughs> She's got textured hair finally. Uh-huh. Here is Glypie. Let's start at the... We also got this gigantic stand. I love it. <laughs> um, these are some of the sickest shoes they've ever made. Ever. Her heel is a carousel skeleton horse. <laughs> yep. She's sick in the head. Um, yeah. Her name is Glypie. Her, like, you know, like a Calliope. That's like that big, like, piano, right? That, like... Is that, like, circuses and stuff? I think so. And then, like, that's the other shoe. Yeah, insanity. And you go up to her drippy body. Oof. And she's pink. And she's pink. Pink. And here's her skirt. Her skirt is made out of circus tent material. Like, I'm pretty sure that's a canon in, like, her her um, her um journal. Cute. That she's so tall that she has to um, make her dress out of, like, the, the circus tent. Hmm. And she's... Just gorgeous. She is, and she's escaped from a lab, if I remember correctly. She's 8108, so like Blob. She's like basically the daughter of the Blob. <laughs> um, That's funny. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. Like, M Mattel's like, how do we do this without having to ask for permission? Yeah. <laughs> and they're like, oh, subject 8108, the Blob. But don't quote me on that, but I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Oh, so yeah, this is uh, this is like the calliope, like that organ type uh, thing. Mm -hmm. There's like the keys right there, and then like the horns that look like screaming faces. They're like, Ooh! <laughs> <laughs> and her hair is a mess, a travesty. I need to wash it. <laughs> um, I need to. Uh -huh. Her makeup, not so much though. It's amazing. Mm -hmm. It is amazing, and. I think they say in the the novel that her earrings are like wheels from one of like the, the cars that broke down or something. That's funny. Crazy. Yeah. Crazy. And she also has that belt. Damn. Everyone but Rochelle got that belt. Whatever. <laughs> and she's got like a neck piece that turns into the, that shoulder piece that like those uh, like the circus masters have. But that has like the tassels coming down oh. with like the, the shoulder pieces. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's amazing. She's got basically a made-to-move body. So she's got, like, those, like, three-point articulated, like, knees. So she can, like, her... She can touch herself here. And she can touch her face. And she can touch her own shoulders. And she detaches here. And not there. To, like, get her clothes off. And I think her hands come off, too. Okay. Um, we have some people that fell down. <laughs> but I hope you guys really enjoyed this. And if you ever see these, like, at a thrift store... Or, like, someone doesn't know what they're selling, do it. Buy them. You will Get not regret them. it. They. This is one of the best, if not, like, the best Monster High line, I think, like, in yeah. completion. If you add in, like, the small lines that were, like, accompanying them. Mm -hmm. So, get them. Um, currently filming a hair tutorial, hair washing, hair video. Yeah. So, that should be up after this. But I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.